Hello everyone, I am back with another video. This video I have been waiting to do all year long. It is officially the end of my freshman year at TSU. Okay, so first and foremost, I know you're all like, why is she doing this video in the car? Like, what's going on? Well, I'm not gonna have time to like actually set up and do a video because by the time I get home, I it's dark or whatever so I'm just not gonna have time to like actually set up and you know do a proper video plus this video is gonna be quick and short so yeah why not do it in my car I'm about to go take my medical terminology test here in a few so I figured I might as well just go ahead and do this little video really quick it's not gonna take long so. So, first things first, my classes were great this semester. Um, I made all A's in my classes, except for my anatomy class and my microbiology class. I made B's in those classes, which hurt, really hurt. That's okay. I still made the D's list and all of that. Um, I had really good classes this semester. Like, yeah, like, I had to work because I was taking a foreign language class on top of two science classes. Um, so I had to definitely put in a lot of work to get those grades, but it was definitely worth it. So now what is next? I'm currently working on my dental hygiene application, which I basically have everything that I need. I'm just waiting on my TSU transcript. So I am hoping to get my transcript in the mail, like today. I just have to put it all together in one big old envelope and then take it to the person that I need to take it to. So that's very exciting. However, it is nerve wracking because I am nervous. Like y'all, if I don't get accepted, I'm gonna flip my. Yeah. So <laughs> I am very nervous. However, it's it. I can't stress about anything. That's out of my control. This is in God's hands. Um, it's in the hands of the people that look at my application, so I, I can't stress about it because I have no control over it. So, as of right now, my class is for next, well I am going, I don't know if I am, I'm probably not, going to take a summer classes, a summer class in July. I'm supposed to take art appreciation in July, but the way, like, if I do get accepted, I'm not taking it because I want to live this summer, like, to the fullest. No stress do whatever I want to do without worrying about a class like I don't want to worry about no type of class this summer if I just accept it because next summer my, my, I don't have one like if I do get accepted then next summer I'll be in the dental hygiene program taking dental hygiene classes and all that stuff so I want to live for this summer and next summer if I do get accepted <laughs> if I do get accepted for the fall 2019 my class but my classes are chemistry college algebra spanish 2 first aid and black arts and literature so let's say i don't get accepted or i get waitlisted then that's going to be my schedule for the fall 2019 however let's say i do get accepted i had to change that whole schedule around because on top of taking dental hygiene courses and chemistry, algebra, Spanish, that's not gonna work. I'm gonna flunk out of college. Like, no, that's not, <laughs> that's not gonna work at all. So, if I do get accepted, then my whole schedule is just gonna like be changed or whatever. To all of my upcoming freshmen that's coming to TSU, or if you're just a freshman in general and you are going into college or whatever. Good luck. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you're gonna make a lot of friends. You're gonna meet a lot of people. Um, you're gonna make a lot. You're gonna make some enemies. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. It's gonna be some people that you don't like. You're gonna have drama. I am not even lying, y'all. Like what I tell y'all, college is just high school on a bigger level. Like these people around here, they still like drama. They still like to do petty stuff. They still like to do all of that. So. Um, just make sure you keep your head on straight. My number one advice is to keep your academics first. Like, your academics coming for anything. It comes for any party, anybody, like anything. So, make sure you just central everything around your academic life. Everything in my life is structured around my academic life. Like, my work schedule, 
and structured around my academic life. Um, I don't really have classes around like the time I work, except for last well, this semester I had a 5.30 class. I don't get off of work until 6. So I would have to leave work at 5 o'clock. Or um, every Tuesday I went to either microbiology tutoring or anatomy tutoring. So every Tuesday I didn't go to work. That's fine with me. Your grades, your classes, your future comes first, like period, like in a discussion. My second piece of advice would be to just to remember that everybody is not your friend. And you can't come into college thinking that everyone is going to be your friend and that you're going to make so many friends and that everyone's going to like you because we all come from different backgrounds. We all were raised differently. We all have different morals, different values, different personalities. We have to keep in mind that, like I said, not everybody's going to like you. Not everyone is going to be your friend. And that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Like, it's not the end of the world. Um, but you can't, like, force don't force yourself on somebody like don't force a friendship like don't force stuff just let stuff happen God will let God let go and let God basically my third piece of advice is to always remember who you are and why you're here because being at TSU it's very easy to like just get distracted just remember like who you are and why you came here in the first place like always keep that in the back of your mind because you know when even not even just like pertaining to getting distracted but even when you're feeling down like oh you made a bad grade on, on your test you're possibly failing the class but you know you came here because you want to make your family proud you want to make your little brother proud you want to make your little sister proud you want to be able to like you know maybe you're a first generation college student I know I am so, like, just keeping a sense of motivation in the back of your head is going to help you. I feel like. Um, so, yeah, that is all that I have to say. Freshman year was awesome. Thank you, TSU, for, you know, making this first, my freshman year, my first year of college. Awesome. I had a blast at homecoming. Um, all the activities that were thrown, I had a blast at Tiger Fest. Freshmen, I wish you all luck. I wish you all um, good luck with your classes. I hope you all make the days list. I hope you all get 4.0s. And I hope you succeed in your entire college career. Remember, freshman year is the foundation. So we are aiming high, okay? 4.0s, period, okay? Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe, comment, all of that. Ask me any type of question you have. Um, and I will see you in the next.